In the movie The Dictator, Aladdin, the dictator of Wadia, is having a discussion with the head scientist of nuclear program Nadal about the aerodynamics of their nuclear missile and production. It is too round on the top, it needs to be pointy. Round is not scary, pointy is scary. Nadal designed a missile that has a round shape which makes Aladdin very angry because Aladdin thinks that a round shaped rocket looks funny and it also looks like a flying dildo. This will put a smile on the faces of the enemy. They will think that it is a huge robot's dildo flying towards them. He also thinks that the top of the nuclear missile should be pointy so that it can look scary to enemies and when it hits the ground it doesn't bounce back. And explain to me how this bomb will not land in Israel and then literally bounce right back and blow up Wadia. That makes sense, right? However, Nadal disagrees and says that being pointy has nothing to do with the aerodynamics of the rocket and they agree to disagree and he got you know you know, executed. What? No. And that scene served as a design inspiration to SpaceX CEO. Elon Musk on a podcast with Joe Rogan admitted that they designed Starship Pointy just because of the movie The Dictator. Um, yeah, Starship, we need to make it more pointy. Did you say that? Mm -hmm. Because of the movie? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Hold on. Bruh. <laughs> <laughs> That's, you literally told them to make the Starship more pointy because of the movie The Dictator. Yep. Um, <laughs> but was is it better to be pointier? Like if, if it wasn't for the it's movie, it's arguably slightly worse. <laughs> <laughs> but why being pointy makes the rocket slightly worse in terms of aerodynamics? There are basically three main reasons to design a rocket not pointy but a little bit round. The reason number one is that increased drag and turbulence reduce the vehicle's stability and flight performance. Turbulence in rockets is caused by the flow of air around the vehicle, which becomes disrupted and unstable due to the presence of sharp edges, corners or irregular shapes. This creates vortices and eddies in the airflow, which can increase drag and reduce stability and cause heat buildup. In some cases, turbulence can even lead to structural failure of vehicle. To minimize turbulence, rockets are designed with smooth, rounded shapes that allow air to flow over the surface in a smooth and stable manner. The reason number two is that higher heat build up due to increased air resistance and friction. Rockets generate high heat during flight due to friction between the rocket and the air, and due to air resistance, also known as aerodynamic heating. The friction and air resistance cause the rocket to rub against the air, generating heat as a result. The heat generated increases with the speed of the rocket and the density of the air, making it especially pronounced during re-entry into the Earth's atmosphere, where the rocket encounters high air density and high speeds. To mitigate this heat, the surface of rockets is often covered with heat-resistant materials, such as ceramic tiles, to prevent damage to the rocket and ensure a safe landing. The reason number two is that increased risk of structural failure or breakup of the vehicle during flight. The intense heat generated during flight can cause structural materials to expand and contract, leading to thermal stress and potential failure. Also, high air resistance and turbulence encountered during flight can generate aerodynamic forces that put stress on the structure, potentially causing failure. You push the button. Boop. Israel. <laughs> 